Danny, it comes to the end of your, your first season in league football. How's the experience been for you? Um, it's, well, it's been a good experience to play in the league. Um, obviously, we've been disappointed with um, performances and, um, and where we are in, in the table. Um, but we've got a big game to sort of pull that behind us and get a big performance out of us. Um, to win a little battle of, out, of the, out of the season we've had. And um, then obviously build on to, to, for the for the club's future in the football league, and uh, to hopefully go on to have a better season than we have this year. You mentioned obviously the big game against Hartlepool, where you do only need a point. But would at home against Hartlepool playing for a point would that be a dangerous game? Yeah, Is it you very, to go yeah. Win? Obviously, yeah, we can't we we can't afford to do that. Um, <clears throat> and we beat. Uh, we've We've got some good results at, uh, at home this season, so there's no reason why we can't go out there uh, and win the game. Um, anyway, so yeah, we've got to go for the win. We've got to play the team, uh, the the performance, the the game that's going to get us that win, and we can't look uh, for anything less than that. Um, obviously, we do only need the draw, but like you say, three points would be um, a better end to the season for the fans, um, and hopefully uh, that can sort of build. Um, for the for the club's future. Now, obviously, both teams with so much so much to play <coughs> for, and, and as cliche, cliche as it, it might sound, is it a case of on the day you want in it more than they do? Um, yeah, I think every game is a bit like that. If you want it more than the opposition, you tend to sort of it shows in your in your performance. Um, um, but yeah, it's a, obviously it's a massive game. Both clubs fighting to stay in, in the league. Um, we're confident that we can go there and get the three points. Go there and get the three points. Stay at home and get the three <laughs> points. Um, yeah, we're confident it's on our patch. Um, we've had some good performances there recently um, and throughout the season at home. So yeah, we've, we're confident we've got the game and we can go play uh, um, with that game to, to get the three points this, this Saturday. So there's no reason why we can't do that. Um, big game, we tend to enjoy the big games. Uh, we tend to, we've got players who can perform um, under the pressure, so hopefully uh, yeah, we can produce that Saturday. And will there be any nerves on your behalf? Um, there will be nerves. There's nerves going into every game, really. But um, I think you, you can use that sort of nervousness to to produce a, the bet your best game. Um, you can sort of have to get them butterflies in your belly and use it to bring out uh, bring out the best in you. Um, I don't think uh, you can worry about that too much. Um, it's, it's a big game and you should look forward to playing in these games rather than uh, be nervous um, about not uh, performing. So yeah, um, there will be nerves but we've got uh, a great team and a great squad that can produce um, in the big games like this and I'm sure we will Saturday. And what's the message been from the coaching staff? Are you using the fact that it is such a big game to sort of add fuel to the fire so to speak? Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I don't None of us need anyone to tell us how important this game is for the club. We feel it. We are part um, of everything that this club is about um, as, as players. And uh, yeah, the, the coaching staff um, we, we have put together a game that we think we can get three points. And uh, it's been going really well this week. And, and we, we're confident we can produce that. But um, yeah, every single one of them players um, that are down there I've just spoke to and um, all of us this week understand how, how big it is for the club and uh, we, we, can, we know that uh, we can use that to get a performance out of us. Have you approached the game any differently in training? Um, no, not any differently. We've, you work, every game is different in terms of how you're going to go about it tactically and to, to get a result. Um, so this has been no different in terms of just adapting to who you're playing and, and, this, and the situation. Um, but yeah, it's uh, that we understand how big the game is. I've said it a few times now. Um, it's hard week of training. It's been a good week of training. Um, I'm sure we can produce it this weekend. Obviously, no club wants to go down, but and it's a massive deal for Chatham Town Football Club. But what what will it mean just to the players after such a long, uh, you know, difficult season, up and downs, ups and downs? What will it mean to the players to to get the job done on on, on Saturday? Yeah, it's it's everything. It's everything about um, this season. It is about winning this weekend, and 
um, that this season is nothing is what poles apart compared to our season last year. But this win Saturday would feel a little bit um, like how we did in the times last year. Um, totally, like I say, poles apart in terms of performances throughout the whole of the season. But a big win this Saturday is a is a little is a is a little battle that we we win. Um, in a disappointing year, this battle Saturday is a is a battle that we can win and we can enjoy. Um, we can enjoy the result when when we win, um, and enjoy it just as much as uh, as any other. Um, to, to, so to to keep the status of the football of this football club in the league this year is is a is a big achievement. Um, looking at the situation this Saturday, and and that's what we're aiming to, aiming to do, and obviously success in that, um, we will be will be happy to achieve that. Yeah. And finally, from me, I imagine the club are expecting a sellout crowd at Warren Road with the reduced ticket prices and the 12th man campaign. What would, what would be your message to the fans attending on, on Saturday? Just yeah, just be like you have all year in fine voice. Um, be loud. Be supportive of the boys. Get behind us um, for 90 minutes or 90, however many minutes. Um, there'll be times in the game when it's not going quite how we want it. Just keep going behind us because it, it means. It do, really does get the get the lads firing, um, and when the when the atmosphere is rocking, it you get a buzz in your, in yourself, and it does produce a better performance out of the out of all of us. So yeah, just be in fine voice like you have all year, and uh, cheer us home to victory. Oh, cheers, Danny. Thank you very much. Thank you. And the last time I spoke to you was after the Barney game, which was a, some very worrying faces around after that game, wasn't there? But you've had four decent performances since then, and only one disappointing one, probably, haven't you? Yeah, um, obviously the Barnet game was a back of four disappointing results. So to turn it round and get four positive performances, um, where we felt we could have picked up a few more points than we did, um, it was a good sort of um, character of the. It was a good show of character, judge of character from the lads to show that we could bounce back from a disappointing. Um, and we've got to do that again this week. Obviously, we weren't happy with the result. Last week at Blackpool, um, and we can do that again this weekend. Bounce back from that um, in, in the big game, and let's just go and show what we can do. Um, and obviously, a lot of people, including myself, is, are playing for futures in our careers. So it's it's a big game for everybody, and uh, we're looking forward to to playing in it. Yeah, do you think the little spell? Cause you've, you've had a good run back in the team there. Do you think the little spell where Carl Wooden was playing? Do you yeah. think you needed that little breather? Um, yeah, I probably did. Um, Carl done well and he came in. He um, picked up some great results um, away at Luton. He was fantastic. Um, Springs, I think that stands out in the top of mind. But um, yeah, I was probably in a bit of a rut myself at that particular point. Needed to. I was trying to battle out of it by keep playing, and for some reason I couldn't do that. And it probably did help me to sit out for the team and just refresh the mind a little. Um, but I feel good. I feel. I'd like to score more goals in the last few games, but um, I feel good and um, yeah, I'm ready to give the performance of the season this weekend and hopefully uh, that'll be what we what we get and from all the lads, that's, like, that's what we're hoping for and we're working hard to achieve that. Yeah. yeah, you had to wait 31 years for this chance, didn't you? And if <laughs> it could come down to the next couple of games, people will say, oh, he wasn't good enough for the Football League. If you go down, weren't they probably? And if you, if you stay yeah. up, people will say, well, maybe he was good enough for the Football yeah, League. Yeah, that's probably exactly what will happen to me. Either way, um, I'm determined to make sure I am good enough for the football league. Um, it's Saturday. This Saturday, it's, it can't be any bigger, can it? So um, we're looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, it's, should be. A, it's a great game for us. It's like it's not. It's, it's all the talking can be done. It's a great game for us. It's a great game for every individual, every team, like us as a team. Um, it's a great game for this club to stay in the Football League and, uh, and build on build on that for the next year. Yeah, I know there'll be a lot of analysis and stuff going on when the season's done, but if you could have taken the, the team from last season that finished so strongly after getting the title, you know, everyone was in good form and you, you're winning every week, do you think that team, because obviously a lot has happened with injuries and, and a lot of stuff has happened to hamper that, but if you could have kept that team and that form, do you think you'd be up there, you know, where Grimsby are or if not higher? Yeah. Um... Yeah, I, I probably do believe that, but uh, you, 
you, no one knows. Um, we had injuries, we had one thing or another, um, but we couldn't, we weren't able to play exactly the same team. But then uh, with me and the few of the lads that were playing, we weren't good enough either. So um, we can't, I can't just say, oh, because I weren't playing in the same team as last year, I've not performed as, as well as I'd like. So um, I have to take a bit of responsibility for that. Um, everyone does personally. Um, and uh, prove that we're good enough. I can't do nothing about the past, I've got to prove that I'm good enough in, in the future. So starting this Saturday, um, it'll, we're determined to, to do that and put, thing, put a few things wrong this season, put it right this weekend and, and obviously build on that for the future. Yeah, and in terms of central defenders, you obviously knew they were going to be better and there's been games where you've still had a lot of success and there's been games where you've obviously been kept quiet and been right. So how much harder has it been, those little um, individual battles? Yeah, it's definitely tougher. Um, it's definitely it's me playing against uh, better quality opposition um, teams as well. Um, uh, better teams, obviously, you're getting less of the ball. You, it's more important to when you do get it, you do something with it, or you don't give it away cheaply. So it's um, it is a big battle. Um, it's tougher if you step up the leagues, but I believe I'm good enough um, at this level. And obviously, like I say, you've got. Prove that starting this weekend um, in a big game for everyone involved, and I'm, I, I'm looking forward to it, and I think all of us are. Um, so let's bring it on. Yeah, just finally, Danny, you, you had to miss a couple of the key games at the end of last season, didn't you? You had to sit and watch, yeah. and then get involved with the celebrations and stuff afterwards. But how nice would it be to be right in the thick of it on Saturday? Yeah, and get de the job yeah, done? definitely. Um, obviously, unfortunate. Last, well, it wasn't unfortunate. I was a bit silly last year to miss. The sort of celebration, the confirm confirmation of us winning the actual league, but um, obviously a big part of everything we've done last year, and uh, to be a part of it this year's year has been a great experience, um, and to enjoy it Saturday will be just as special to keep the club uh, keep keep this club's football league status, um, which like I say we're all in, looking forward to doing. Um, everyone is looking join it in this week, and hopefully we can take it into Saturday. Danny, just very quickly, because it's because you've had to wait so long to get into the football league personally, do you find yourself telling some of the guys in the squad who, who perhaps haven't had to to work and wait as long as you have for this experience, reminding them of the importance of, of Saturday's match and, and reminding them of, of the importance of staying in the football league, not just for them, but for yeah. the club as well? Yeah, um, I think that's just with a bit of experience in general, it's not the fact that I mean, it, it does help. I probably I've worked my whole career to get to my last, last, later years in my career to be here. Um, I think they, everyone understands the importance um, with the experience in football in general. There's always stuff you can relate to younger lads and and, and your teammates across the pitch. But that's uh, that happens during a game. It happens uh, when you're talking to them after, when you're meeting for a coffee, like. After training, there's always experience you can uh, relate to to people who have yet to experience situations. But um, everyone understands the seriousness of this game. Everyone understands what they need to do to get a result for us Saturday. Um, and like I say, everyone's looking forward to it, and we can't wait for it to get here. And we can't wait. The morning road should be buzzing. There should be a real buzz about the place, and so everyone's itching to get out there. And um, yeah, we can't wait to just. Juice of performance to get us a, get us the three points.